Welcome to Arc Solution, your go-to destination for all things related to technology and software solutions. Our channel is dedicated to providing you with expert insights, tips, and tutorials to help you navigate the constantly evolving world of technology. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell to stay updated with our latest content. Thank you for tuning in to Arc Solution. Welcome back guys in Node-RAID series. In Node-RAID series we have learned about the how to install Node-RAID and how to connect with PLC. Right now though we are the going forward and uh, study about the how to we can connect the SQL data and the read the SQL data from the Node-RAID. So here is the step to be followed. First we need to be open the Node-RAID, then open install the MS SQL palettes, then uh, configure MS SQL node and the, we can be able to read the, the data and the use the data. So on the first steps open node reads. So it is a very use we are very common system procedure right now. So go for the command prompt and write down the node dash read. So as we know already so so once once the we run the node node red command, the node red will be there restarted and the it will the it will the upload the old old backups and palettes and nodes. Then it will show to you. So guys, you know that every time the we can save in the data in the SQL SQL table, but from the SQL table we require to read the data data various various way so sometimes we require the read the data sometimes we require the write the data so all of this we can understand and we can check here is the node is running so here is the ip for the startup so we can we can browse it from the explorer node node palette will be the shown to you and it will show to um, uh, flow flow of the objects so previously previous flow and the new flow so i'll just delete the all the flow diagrams so go for the then then we go for the first step is the done that is the open the open the node red. then the second step is the install the ms sql palettes to to ms SQL, uh, install the ms sql palette go for the setting and the palette manage manage palette main palette and here you can search ms sql so you can uh, you can see that the node red contrib ms sql uh, install confirm to install and it will take some time to install so it may be the um, create uh, install will be the one one or two minutes guys node red ka humne features फीचर्स के बारे में एक 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 स्टडी कर रहे हैं जैसे लास्ट टाइम हमने रेड किया कि पीएलसी से हम डेटा कैसे रीड कर सकते हैं और पीएलसी में डेटा राइट कैसे कर सकते हैं ये सीमेंस का ये सीमेंस के पीएलसी सारे पीएलसी में अभी हम स्टडी कर रहे हैं कि एसक्यूएल के बारे में और आगे जाके बहुत सारे स्टप्स हम सीखेंगे नोड रेड के थ्रू जैसे कि कोई एस फाइल है तो हमें एस फाइल में डेटा कैसे राइट करना है या एस फाइल में से डेटा uh, कैसे रीड करना है ये सारा स्टफ सीखेंगे ये नोड रीड है बहुत ही काम की ओके यहाँ पे देखिए एम एस एस क्यू एल का नोड हमारे यहाँ इंस्टॉल हो गया दैट मीन्स द ओवर द सेकेंड स्टेप इज द डन सो वी गो फॉर द नीड कॉन्फिगर द एम एस एस क्यू एल नोड सो एम एस फॉर द कॉन्फिगर एम एस एस क्यू एल नोड यू कैन सर्च इट देर इज द एम एस एस क्यू एल नोड जस्ट ट्रैग एंड ड्रैग इट and uh, we required some configuration so we required to create a connection to create the connection we can write the any connection the sql connection is okay here I'll, I'll write the just the sql connection then the server name so server name obviously it's your server name so that is the sql server name so here right i'll just copy this server name my server name is the desktop this, this is the express server so i'll write that and the username and the password for the sql algorithm user and password and then 
database name where we want to the connect so in my case i'll just connect it and check the what is the database okay database names so xpad is l database is my db i'll just copy it my db and put it in connection put it in database okay i'll just add this connection and done okay so the sql connection is done so we need to be use the sql connection so for that sql connection we required some query i'll just make the some simple inject inject complication in inject or debug for the visualization for your visualization for the understanding how the ms sql is done or uh, how the response of the ms sql get it okay deploy then we need to be implement the query so for the query i'll just put it in the string so here is the query set uh, select the star from the table as usual you know that the query is a common query so we can able to the read the data from the from the table i have deployed it okay and i'll just inject once it is injected the query result will be the shows to you so it will shows to the near about 20 object first object is there is the same object is available in the table first object okay uh, we can make it uh, some specified query specified objects so here uh, agent code is equal to i'll make it specific agent code so we can get the specific agent code name the uh, agent code data so here is the a001 okay i'll just copy that this query execution in execution you can able to see that the, the a result is the one only single object i'll make it in injectable okay i'll make it separate a separate inject and from the inject i'll make but it is not a time series it is a, a read okay a read one or two Okay. This is string and connect to the MS SQL node. So like I see here the to to access the MS SQL. We can mm, put it multiple object. Okay. Here is the result for the single uh, single uh, user and uh, from the above you can see the mm, multiple result. Once uh, there is a no condition. So using like that uh, multiple query you can you can do it. Thank you guys. I see channel ko subscribe kateri.